Hi, I'm Matt Jafoon, co-founder of Occupier. Are you struggling to keep your team and stakeholders on the same page with the progress of your lease deals? If so, you're not alone. Many transaction managers and brokers struggle with real estate deal pipeline management, which can lead to missed opportunities and poor decision making during the deal process. The good news is, there's a solution. A commercial real estate deal pipeline tracker. A deal pipeline is the process or series of stages that a commercial real estate deal goes through, from initial contact all the way to closing and signing of the lease. This is essential for keeping track of all the deals in your pipeline, tracking progress, and ensuring that no deal falls through the cracks and your dates are hit. Commercial real estate is a highly competitive and dynamic industry where timing and accuracy can make or break a deal. Staying on top of your active deals ensures that they are moving forward in a timely manner and you make the best decisions for your business. I have our commercial real estate deal pipeline tracker here. Click the link in our description below to download access to this free Excel template. With Occupier's commercial real estate deal pipeline tracker, you can cu customize the fields to fit your specific needs, include fields for lease deal stages, sources, comments, and any other relevant information for your business. You can input all of your deals into this one tracker, including their current stage and any notes or comments. You can update the tracker regularly to keep people informed on where deals sit in the pipeline. And you can use this tracker to ad identify trends and patterns in your deals and adjust your business strategy accordingly. What you'll see here is that there are two tabs at the bottom, one for the tenant deal pipeline and one for the broker deal pipeline. The major distinction in these two tabs is that for a broker, you can track deals on a client by client basis. So whether you're dealing with one large multinational tenant or multiple deals uh, with uh, various companies, you can track all of your deals in one place. Let's just go through a quick example of how this is used. I have my deal name here and what I'm going to call this is Boston Expansion Deal. And because we're just starting out, I'm gonna put this deal in the planning stage. You can see here all the deal stages that are relevant to my business can be fully customized to my deal process. This is a high priority deal. And of course, we're looking here in Boston, which is in Massachusetts. And we're gonna call this an office deal. We're expanding from 20 to 30,000 square feet, so we're gonna call this a 30,000 square foot requirement. And my rent is typically going to be the target rent that I'm looking for, so I'm going to call this $75 per square foot. My next critical date is essentially the date that is going to drive my real estate decision. So you want to make sure that you're tracking this uh, on a deal-by-deal -deal basis. So we're just going to say Jan 1, 2024, and the critical date type here is that my lease is expiring. Of course, these columns can be uh, updated, customized, changed, ch the order of them can change, uh, but essentially this is a flexible spreadsheet that you could use for all the data that you want to track and communicate with your team. Uh, my due date for this deal is gonna, going to be by the end of June 2024, so we think this is going to take six months to complete. And my desired occup occupancy date is going to be a few months after signing that lease, so let's just say it's going to be October 2024. And this latest update is typically used to communicate progress on the deal. So if I were the uh, head of real estate, I might want to put an update in here. You might also collaborate on the spreadsheet with your broker who might say that we are finalizing the tour list. It's that simple. So essentially this spreadsheet allows you to track all of your deals in one place uh, from a handful of deals all the way to hundreds. Of course, a better way to do this is in software, and you can check that out at occupier.com, but please feel free to download this free resource on our website. Thank you.